Greetings, Earthlings, and welcome back. So today I am going to be playing with yellow. Ooh. I really don't know what I'm gonna do. Have fun. It'd be a fun look. I just want to have fun. Um, have fun. <laughs> if you like fun, you've come to the right place. Isn't it fun? Uh, no, I didn't want to do like a typical my daytime look, my five minute look. My blah, 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 blah. I just wanted to be a little bit more free and uh, have fun. Does my background look okay? I'm gonna use the Makeup Forever HD in the shade R220. Oh, this is really light. We gotta pick up the pace! Then I'm gonna set that with my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish. I went ahead and zoomed in. All right, so I'm gonna take this Huda Beauty 3D highlighter palette and I'm going to pick up Aruba. I'm basically just gonna like contour where I normally would. Something. And I'm also going to like sweep it. My nose. Mac Hyper Real Glow, and I don't know what shade this is, but it's the first one. Take that to my cheekbone. Also gonna take that to the tip of my nose. Down. I'm going to take Makeup Forever's Aqua XL M40. I picked up just a bit on uh, an eyeshadow brush and I'm going to take that to my lid. And I'm basically just going to paint this all over. This is so fun, you guys. Oh my gosh, I haven't played with color in such a long time. It feels good. I can definitely get used to this again. Once you get to the edges, just kind of like blend it outward. So it kind of just blends away. Oh, this is so fun. The rise of social media and all these makeup gurus and beautiful artists and girls coming out it just kind of made me go into my shell a little bit because I'm like I went through this phase of just comparison I can't do it like that then I'm not good enough you know but now I'm just like why not me so I think I'm like just coming back into myself that creative part of myself I don't have to do an Instagram baddie look you know or I don't have to do these these trends, I just want to do me, and I, I even forgot like how to do that, to be honest. I feel like I'm getting there again, you know? This is Nat Natasha- oh my god, one just fell out. Oh my god, no, it broke. That really sucks. Oh man, I think it's not the one we need. Taking the gold shade. I'm going to use the same brush, I'm going to pick up the gold shade, and I'm going to wet it with a makeup setting spray, just to make it more poppy. And I'm going to press this on the lid. This gold is insane. Wow. So pretty. Look at my eyes! Ah! You see how crazy they are? Alright, and then I'm going to take this L'Oreal Infallible uh, Jet Set Blonde. Take the yellow side. This on the lower lash line. And then I'm going to take my finger and just tap it downward. 
before when I would play with makeup, it wasn't, or like film videos, it never really was, like I was never in my head about it. I just did it. I didn't, you know, I didn't have anyone else to compare myself to because when I started YouTube and I started, you know, social media, there wasn't, it was a very small pond. You know, <laughs> I got thrown into the ocean with all of these other amazing people and uh, it really, uh, I, I really let it get to me. You know, the, the mind chatter, that dark mind chatter when you, you're like, I can't do it like that. I can't take photos like that. Um, I don't look like that. I don't, you know, I, all these things that we, all those places that we go to when we compare ourselves. And so I would play with colors and I would do like crazy looks and oh my God, I'm, I'm gonna get emotional. <clears throat> like I miss that, I miss that part of me and um, I think I was trying to find that in painting, which I'm still gonna paint, but my heart is here. It's in it's in the makeup, it's in the dress up and you know, just having fun without caring what anyone else thinks. And it feels really, really good to be there. My number one priority is me being authentic to me and just really had to get back into this space and I just had to, had to stop and kind of like talk about it because it feels feels good to have yellow all over my face. It really does and it's like this process, um, you know, doing makeup, it's so therapeutic. I guess my message to you guys would just be like, don't be afraid to have fun and you know, play around with a red lipstick or play around however you want to play around. Glitter. All right, next we're gonna bust out with some glitter. Be excited about this. I'm gonna take the model's own glitter setting gel. I use my ring finger to pick just very little up and then I'm going to like tap that on top of the yellow very lightly. Then I'm gonna take this glitter, so, so pretty, like so. I'm gonna tap that, oh my God, kind of shake, yeah, shake your finger a little. Kind of take this to the inner corner. I'm gonna take the highlighter that we used for the face, take that to the brow bone. I have these little gold stars, they're confetti. I'm gonna put it in the middle of my head. I put a little glitter glue on the star. Stick it right here. That's fun. Put some lashes on. I'm gonna skip liner and mascara. All right, so I'm gonna take some mascara to the tips of the lashes. I'm not some clumsy idiot. Okay, what? No. Just slip. Mac Frost in Spoiled Fabulous. That's fun. So I didn't show this part on camera, but under my brow, I just took the Makeup Forever paint and I just like went underneath it with the angled eyeliner brush underneath the brows. Just like, I don't even know why I did that. <laughs> I'm gonna take this angled eyeliner brush and that Makeup Forever paint. And honestly, I don't know what I'm doing. I think I'm gonna... Put yellow under here. And then... And I also took it just above the cupid's bow. Now I'm gonna put some glitter on my lips. <laughs> this, I don't know what glitter this is, but it's beautiful. It's different from what's under the eye. Take it on my finger. Hmm. I'm going to take this gold again from the Natasha Denona palette. I'm just gonna take that underneath. Kind of bring it onto the cheek. Above the brows. And you know what? Oh, did I just get that on the upper lip? No! Darn it, now it's on the top. I don't know what I'm doing. 
but my chin is lit AF. All right, so that is it. I need to go edit a video that is gonna go up today and then this video is gonna go up in a couple of days. So thank you guys so much for watching it. This was really, really fun. I would love to inspire you guys to create something kind of fun like this that is your that reflects your inner goddess. So uh, kind of do some self-reflecting, get in tune, and you may be surprised what you come up with. Uh, again, there's no right or wrong. Just kind of have fun with it. Let it be therapeutic. And uh, yeah, tag me. I would love to see. I'll see you next time. Peace. <sighs>